Well, Kendis, sources are telling us that police have surveillance video of the men responsible. They were seen following the victim to this apartment building behind me there. That's where everything went down. You see that bouquet of flowers there? Well, neighbors left that to honor a wife and mother. Police are back at the scene of an attempted robbery that turned into cold-blooded murder after a 57-year-old woman tried to save her husband, who was being robbed in the hallway of their apartment building. That's when police say the would-be robber pointed his weapon and shot the woman in the face. Her husband and son witnessed it all. I thought the gunshot was a door slamming. Um, just heard a loud shriek and then a lot of muffled yelling. Um, there seemed to be a struggle in the stairwell. Some neighbors of the building on the Lower East Side say they heard noises in the hallway, but did not know what to make of it. They spoke with us, but did not want to appear on camera. I heard something, you know, I heard an altercation, but I, I wasn't really too sure. And, you know, I was just fearing for my safety and safety of my roommates. It was around 11 Monday night. Police say two men followed Ying Zhu Lu's husband into their condo building up to the eighth floor and tried to rob him. Apparently, Lu came out to help her husband and was shot as a result. I mean, I'm in shock. It's devastating. It's gruesome. Uh, you never think something like that would happen so close to you. It just, it just shows that even with you know all these precautions, you know, there's always a chance that you know something can happen. Of course, the son and husband are both devastated after all of this. Police say the men got away with a cell phone and $100. But of course, this family lost so much more. If you have any information on this, call Crime Stoppers. The number's right there. It's 800-577-TIPS. For now, we're live on the Lower East Side. Nicole Johnson, PIX11 News.